Hi guys, today exciting news. Uh, turned on the business center and what I see Trimble Business Center version 5.9.1 now available. This came up in July 20th. So let's go through it and see what we can find out about um, what's what been upgraded or what new things we have so uh, you can upgrade to 5.90.1 by clicking the check update button uh, button and but you have to have a valid license as of may 1 2023 if your license expired before that do not upgrade because you won't have any uh, access to any new features so uh, what else we have uh, this release of Trimble Business Center includes several new features and a number of bug fixes for a complete list and additional details see TBC readme file so um, here we go let's visit the web page let me load that up here for ya okay so um, Uh, here we go uh, okay here is TBC patch the same thing so maybe let's go to release now oh, there we go read me and uh, here we go uh, enhancement mobile mapping batch export you can now export mobile mapping data within the batch routine uh, point cloud exports uh, and who whole bunch so those were would be two enhancements so for the scanning stuff uh, of bug fixes uh, some mobile mapping fixes the TBC would freeze when hover maskers on a trajectory deleting scans and round splitting an error occur when selecting coordinate system for recently used wrist yes I seen that TBC was unable to publish 3d data station view to Trimble Clarity, files could not be exported from Trimble Connect, an error occurred when importing scan data, when using extra line feature um, from a point cloud the extraction process could stop, if the shrink wrap command was used create region outline points and project was closed reopened an error occurred the drawing could not be opened. When using create points from CAD command to create points, lines, vertical information, the points had no elevations. I think I seen that and I thought it's something else. An order occurred when the using change elevation command to change elevation to reference surface. An error occurred after using best fit line command create uh, um, create a line and to recomputing or closing and opening the project. The best fit line common could not be used with the point cloud data. Couple of enhancement uh, bug fixes for aerial photogrammetry. The import of aerial photogrammetry data could fail because TBC was unable to identify to identify the correct important to use. Phantom 4 RTK antenna type was named incorrectly. TBC was not able to read SenseFly action tag. Importing DJIM 3E data could not could cause an error. Imported data sets did not include high precision GNSS and GPCs. In some scenarios, uh, there was an exemption when you are doing earthwork summary. The sort by column function did not work in the points to surface command and pile plan exporter. Uh, was incorrect pile plan so here is the actual PDF which is basically the same what we just uh, read so let's go and see if we can install it real quick so I'm gonna hit check for updates haven't done it in a while so there is quite a few of them uh, I am gonna check the TBC business center patch uh, I like to save the update before so it's gonna ask me where do I save it I believe I think I have uh, here and I'm just gonna create a TBC 
uh, underscore five point nine zero point one patch and of course I don't know how to spell <laughs> patch and I'm gonna go save while we're saving uh, want to take that opportunity don't forget to subscribe comment what you would like to see so I can get back to you it's greatly appreciated uh, hope you are enjoying these videos there is way more on the channel so go check them out okay we are 50 percent again this would probably uh, depend uh, on your speed of the internet so i am on the starlink so pretty decent than i used to be so let's keep on going 70 percent Eighty. Okay, so we are at hundred percent, and let's see now it's installing. Okay, unfortunately it's here, so installing. Let's see computing space requirements. this is taking a while I haven't done the startup uh, of business center so I'll do it at uh, 5.9.1 and, and compare it to uh, the other ones I'll have to get on that uh, it's been summer quite busy doing lots of modeling and uh, even some surveying out in the field so it's time to be jolly right now so I've been uh, procrastinating the channel a little bit so hopefully it's okay with you guys uh, you know you can always hit me up with your questions and everything I'll try to help out as much as possible wondering if it wants me to close the business center no okay so hit update mm, yes technically it's a patch so it shouldn't take long um, as the full install We are about uh, 80 minutes in, all in uh, with the reading of uh, the notes there. I'm a lot. I'm excited about the improvements on the stability of some comments. So I've been experiencing some freezing of TBC lately on my laptop, but uh, I'm, I'm suspecting that is uh, either graphics card or something related to that. So okay so we are validating the install
Okay, so here is the first one, the setup must update files, cannot update the product room. So it wants me to close the business center. Uh, I will close the business center, hit OK, and hopefully I don't have to reboot the computer afterwards. So, so far, yeah, okay, yeah. So it, like I said, it's nicely guided through us. Now it's copying new files, so it's kind of picking up some speed here. Okay, so it's successfully installed, so I'm gonna hit finish. Uh, again, it prompted out to restart. I'm gonna do that later. Let's see if I can start up the TBC right now and see if it uh, starts us up here. 5.9, so it doesn't show the version up front there, it's just showing 5.9, not 5.90.1. So I just want to open it up and look at about section. Maybe that one will say 5.1, 5.9.1. So here we go, Trimble Business Center. Uh, again, check for updates. So we should not see the patch here. Yeah, the patch is gone. And if we go to support and about, uh, yeah, this doesn't say anything about 5.91 but uh, let's say release notes are uh, yeah so yeah so hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next next time with some other tips and tricks uh, see you